Hi, today we're doing a homemade kofta spice mix. If you remember rightly, towards the beginning of our series, I made some easy lamb koftas. Well, I did everything individually with those koftas, including adding the spices. This is a cheats way. So if you make your spice mix up, have it in an con airtight container in your pantry or even in your fridge. A lot of people keep these sort of things in the refrigerator. So first off, if you've got a food processor or um, I don't know, what do you call these? Turbo blitzers, whatever. So I'm actually going to do a double quantity only because I know that I will use it again in the future. So first off, coriander seeds. I've actually got a beautiful coriander plants gone to seed. We had to harvest my own before long. These are cumin seeds, so do the same. Two tablespoons. Always keep your, your spices and your herbs and that really well sealed. They do lose potency. Whole black peppercorns, two teaspoons. You can always experiment. Try different types of peppercorns, see how you go. Okay, allspice. Now we need one teaspoon of allspice. I know that's not gonna be there, so being careful. And I know you haven't seen me measuring out spices before, so it's a novelty for you. Cardamom seeds. Now these are cardamom pods. Inside the pod, if you get them, black ones really are the better for this type of thing, but I couldn't find them. If you open them up, but inside there's little tiny seeds. There they go. Okay, so that pod is empty now. And they're the seeds. Whoop, see how tiny they are? When you're using, normally, like if you're making a curry or a lot of dishes, you use the pods whole. You can put them in whole and then if you don't like to find a lump whilst you're eating, you just take them out because the flavour is still there. So we need, and because we're blitzing it, it'll all be crushed up so it doesn't matter. But we're going to need one teaspoon of cardamom pot and turmeric. The health values of turmeric, huge. Very, very popular at the moment. So it's a half a teaspoon of the recipe. Don't forget, we're doing double, so we're going one teaspoon. Wouldn't want to have the shakes doing this, would you? Okay, so now we're going to put the lid on and try and put it on the, the noisy machine and blitz it. Here's our Mr. Zoom, and here we go. Watch your ears. Let it go. Don't forget, always make sure that your machine is totally finished turning. Otherwise, you will damage the rotor. Just have a peeky. Make sure that all the bits are blitzed. Uh, might put it in for another on um, for another couple of seconds. There's just a couple of little bits of the cardamom pot. Hold your ears. That should do it. Push it off. Tap it down. Get rid of that. Oh yeah. So don't know if you can see in there. It's all lovely and fine. Okay, so then we get on to our next step. 